Well, good morning, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages. <laughs> Today, I'm going back to the original intent of this channel, and we're going fishing. I don't know if m Mama can get the back seat, but we got the boy laying down back there. We got all the fishing rods. But we're going for something that's gonna be a bit of a challenge today. I may not catch a single thing. I may not get a single bite. Cause I've never, never gone after this type of fish before in my life. We're going after some tiger musky today. I've never fished for pike. I've never fished for musky. But I'm going to a lake that is supposed to be really good and the action's supposed to be really hot for uh, muskies. I, I looked at the report from last week and they say that the small muskies, which are like 24 to 30 inches, um, are biting really well right now because they're the younger ones and they're more aggressive. They say that the, the bigger ones, which there are bigger ones, like 40 to 50 inch fish in there, um, you can still catch them, but they're, you know, they're the slower, a little bit older, a little bit wiser fish that might have been caught a few times. Um, they're a little bit harder to get on the hook. Can I pan? Yes, you can pan. We got uh, some uh, hot air balloons going up right now. And I'm really hoping that the place that I want to go for breakfast is open at 630 in the morning. You know, America runs on it. <laughs> Duncan. Yes, we're going to Dunkin' Donuts for breakfast. All right, guys, we're gonna head to Walmart real quick after this, because I forgot to get ice for our cooler. And I will see you guys there. All right, guys, we are inside Wally World on a mission to get in and out as quickly as possible. What do we need again? Tissues, sandals, shirt, ice. Uh, and ice. Oh, uh, Ziplocs. Anyway, here comes the tissue. All right, we'll catch you a little bit later, guys. All right, guys, this is the, I'm sure most of you guys know this section. The Walmart fishing section. They're all pretty much the same. Every now and then you can find good deals. And the tiger muskies that we are going after today were introduced to combat goldfish. So I'm looking to see if I can find something on sale that might be orange um, or, or yellowish orange or like red and yellow. You see anything, babe? Oh, there's one down there. Oh, that's seven bucks. Oh, there's another one that's five, six bucks. Oh, well, we'll see what we can find, guys. Well, we checked the fishing area in Walmart. Didn't find a whole lot that we didn't already have. So, we're going to go with what we got and not spend any money. All right, boys and girls, it is 7.46 in the morning, and we are finally, finally on the road. Thought I had taken care of all the shopping we needed last night, but no, ended up having to go to Walmart this morning um, just to pick up a few things. Got out of Walmart for, what, 10 bucks? Thumbs up. <laughs> um, the... Uh, I ended up having to make an extra stop because my uh, both of my front tires looked a little bit low and the place where I normally get, get them aired up at, Discount Tire, was closed on a Sunday. Well, we're on a downhill slope and that truck sped up, so we'll slide right back in behind him. But we went to the gas station and 
filled up the front tires, got our Walmart stop done, got our breakfast done. We're finally on the road, probably about an hour later than I wanted to be, but it's still gonna be a good day. We're still gonna have fun. And I will see you guys when we're a little bit closer. All right, babe, are you sure you wanna go to the lake? I guess. You sure you, you don't want to go here? To the casino? Route 66 casino. No. You don't want to go drop 20 in the machine? We got Connor. We'll leave him out in the car. With the windows up. In the desert. In the middle of August. You're crazy. <laughs> I'm just kidding, guys. No, we're going to go right past Route 66 casino. We're going out to the water today. Here we go, boys and girls. This is what we are here to get. Bag limit is one fish over 40 inches. Even if I catch one over 40 inches, I'm not keeping it today. I'm gonna to be releasing everything back into the water. Um, one, because I just, I got nowhere to keep it in the car. You know, I didn't bring a huge cooler. I've got a little cloth uh, ice cooler. But hopefully we catch one or two and uh, it's a cool little carving. And we have a good day. All right, guys, we are here at Blue Water. And the water is blue. I'll give them that. We've gone around to the primitive camping side, meaning there's some, there's some people camping up there, but there's no facilities. There is a restroom up there, but it's just a potty like there's no running water there's no um, I don't know we're gonna figure it out I think we may have to we've got all our stuff with us in a wagon that my wife is pulling I may switch with her because getting it down here and down to the water oh look those guys down there they just pulled one out Looks like they're letting it back go awesome it's hard to see on this camera on this phone camera but it's a decent sized tiger musky all right guys so we're starting out today with something a little different uh, well the guy that gave it to me called it a water dog and he's got live ones over there and he had a dead one and he said give this a shot so we're gonna throw this out we got it on a bobber literally about a foot and a half below with a big circle hook and he said the dead ones work just as well as the live ones so we're gonna give it a shot all right I'm just let it sit there for a while See what happens. Jim here just hooked into one and he's letting Connor bring him in. Oh boy, look at that, Connor, man. You're the, you're the man. You're the man. Yeah. yeah. You're the man. Okay, 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 okay. Calm down, buddy. It gets uh, You got those. Uh... I had them last time I saw them. Careful with them? With the rod, buddy. That's enough. Don't reel it in anymore. Spoon with a broken treble hook. <laughs> but it works. Back up a little bit. Oh, gonna he's going to bust the tip right here. Back up just a little bit. Right so there. Don't move it anymore. There you, there you go. go. There you want to hold on to him and get a picture? Your dad gets you a picture? Put, just put the pole down. Don't grab him by the mouth, though. Whatever yeah, careful of the mouth. All right, buddy, nice. Let him go. All right, go. Let him go. Let him go. Had a boy. Don't throw him. Set him down gently. Set him down in there gently. He'll be all right. <laughs> there he goes. He's gone. Good job. Thank you, Jim. You're welcome. What do?
She got her snag out of there. Good. Oh. <laughs> Maybe you'll find my hook. Well, I'm to get that out of the water. And it wasn't very far from shore. It was like just a few feet. But we'll get it out of there. Come on. Triple hook and line. All right. Back to it. I've switched up to a uh, jerk bait. Let's see what I catch. Well, just not having the luck today, guys. Beautiful day out here, guys. It'd be even better if I could hook into just one muskie. I like the retrieve on this. I mm, didn't like that though. I like the retrieve on this guy. It's very natural looking, especially for a lure that I spent $3 for ship. Not even $3, $2 for shipping on this. So yeah, guys, I got this off wish.com and they come in multi different colors um but it retrieves very natural and like if you use a stop and go like it wiggles and then it floats up on its side like a like, like a dying fish and then it swims naturally and then it floats up on its side even though i haven't had anything bite it yet i still like it I thought I put, there it is. Try this spoon again. You know what? Time? I think it's time. Alright guys, so 
we're going to give it a shot. It's a little small on the small side for these tiger muskies. But we're bringing out the Richard. Just want them to put it in their mouth. Just the tip. Just the tip, just to see how it feels. All right, it's a little small for these guys, but who knows? Maybe we'll get one of the smaller ones to take it. Take it all. Oh, it does not cast very far. That's right, you dirty girl, take it. <laughs> this wind is not helping. All right, well, that's gonna do it for the Richard. About 20, 30 minutes. No luck on him today. I honestly think he's too small for these big ladies in here and their big mouths. But all I'm looking for today is a fat girl that swallows. <laughs> all right, so we got this spoon today from Jim, the guy who let my son reel in one of his uh, pike. Um, he caught a couple on, on a spoon very similar to this. So, and I actually had one follow it earlier. We're going to give it another shot. You can get some distance with that weight. But you got to reel it in pretty quickly so it doesn't get snagged on the bottom. You know, maybe I'm fishing these things wrong. I don't know. But going a whole day without a bite is really frustrating some days. Oh, yeah!
Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, stay in the water, but get, get the, get the net, get the net. <laughs> it ain't a monster by any means. It's definitely not a keeper, guys. There we go. There we go, boys and girls. Hooked him right in the eye, too. He swiped at it mad. Oh, go get the pliers, please, babe. All right, let's... Well, I'm going to keep him in the water so he stays alive, hopefully. While Mama runs and grabs the... Uh, Fish. No, no, this is a, a tiger muskie. Tiger muskie? Mm-hmm. No, no, no. Here you go. All right. Mm, he's still breathing. All right, I'm going to turn him around this way. Well, I was getting close to it. I had j literally just said. I know. I thought I had heard you say. Going it, all day with. Be it. All right, Mama. Whoa. You need to get in there with those pliers. One more minute. <laughs> you get on the the one that's that's actually hooked, or one of the ones that's actually hooked. Yeah. <laughs> Stuck in his eye. Yeah, well. Yeah. There we go. There we go. All right, Mama. Come grab this camera. It's, it's on. It's recording. All right, guys. This is not a very big one, but it is my first ever. Tiger muskie. He's a good fish. Ah. All right, we're gonna get the release though. No, I'm gonna release him, buddy. My you fish, I release him. There he goes. That was the time I walked in the water, grabbed his again. I caught a fish. All right. Great success. <laughs> Great success of the family. One fish. All one right. Fish. I don't care if I catch anything else today. <laughs> I don't care if we. That was fun. Like, I'd been kind of scraping the bottom. You know, I'd, I'd been feeling my that spoon kind of bounce on the bottom, and that's when that thing s struck. It kind of felt like I struck the bottom again, but all of a sudden, it was pulling back against me. Wait, 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 wait. First time I've ever caught one. That was a lot of fun. Well, guys, there's Harry Potter. The wind picked up. The wind really picked up. Blew my chair over into the water. Right now, we're worrying about this one. And this is who caught it. I switched rods with her, I gave her the spoon. And literally, like, what, two or three casts later, yeah. she's got one in. All right, guys, we're going to turn this off until we release it. Because it's going to be a bear to get that hook out of its mouth. All right, guys, he... This is a tiger muskie's mouth. Look at those teeth. And I got to get that hook out. There we go. All right. You ready to release him? Yep. This guy's a fire. Look at his tail. His tail's bleeding. I don't know if that's from our net or if he got in a fight before this, but 
He's going back in. He'll survive. Come on, guys. Come on. He will. Give him a second, babe. Alright, he's gone. Alright guys, take four. We are on our way home to Albuquerque from uh, Blue Water State Park. It's about a two hour drive. That is unless you stop at Dairy Queen on the way home and get your child a chocolate dipped ice cream cone. Your wife a peanut buster parfait and yourself a small blizzard. We had a good day, but we were hot and sweaty and nasty at the end of it. So we decided to have some ice cream. Had a little tourist trap, hole in the wall. Not really hole in the wall, but it was a tourist trap. Right outside of the state park. Um, they wanted like three bucks to get a fountain drink. That ain't gonna happen. But anyhow, I had a good time. Mama, did you have a good time? Yeah. Did you enjoy catching your first tiger muskie? It was fun. I enjoyed catching my first tiger muskie and we are definitely gonna be heading back. Don't know when, but we will be going back. All right guys, that's gonna do it for me today. If you enjoyed the video, hit that thumbs up, smash the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the little bell notification, and I'll see you guys next time.